नेक्स्ट क्वेश्चन इज इनवोल्यूड ऑफ सर्कल सो वॉट इज द कंसेप्ट ऑफ इनवोल्यूड इनवोल्यूड इज वॉट If I wound a one wire thread or the string on this cylinder, suppose this is the as one string or thread I have wound on this cylinder, which you can see as a circle in the front view. I can show this with different colors. So this is. Let's say a circular base or circle cylinder on which I wound this wire or length of string, which we say depends on the given parameters. Let's see what happens if I keep this one end fixed and if another end is moving, keeping always a tangential or a straight. We have inelastic string. So what is the path covered by this another end? so it may be it is like this so it is depends which end you can fix so let's say the winding what is the definition of involute winding and unwinding shape of the string over a cylinder is or it can be defined as involute so simply what i will do now if i have a cylinder let's say on this side i am keeping its pi distance let's say the length of string is equal to the circumference of circle then this distance will be a pi d and then the path covered by the another end when i wound around this circle or wound around this base it will be like this means if the total length keeping this end fixed keeping always this path tangential tangential to the circular base it will be always a curve like this so the curve which we obtain is involute so this is involute of circle we may have involute of pentagon hexagon any shape so accordingly the length of string or this distance will change it won't be pi d for pentagonal prism or any shape so now we'll see how to draw involute of circle when the length of string is equal to pi d that is circumference of circle so first i will draw a circle of given dimension i'll write the question here draw involute of circle if diameter h Four zero forty mm. Assume, say, many times it is not mentioned, so we assume it. The length of string wind on this cylinder, the length of string is equals to circumference. That is circumference of circle. so that is assumption if the length of string is not mentioned it may be the length of string is greater than pi d or the length of string is less than pi d distance okay so we'll draw this problem first how to draw this draw a circle of given dimension with the 40 mm so we'll take radius 20 mm and i will draw one circle So question in volute of circle 40 mm diameter I will draw circle. So 
So draw a circle, divide in equal 8 parts. Let's say I am keeping this in 0. Keeping this 1, 2, 3, 4 like this. This is 7 and this one will be 8. So first and last point is always 0 and last one will be 8. Now assuming length of string is same as pi d. So I will draw a pi d distance. Let's say from 0 I will mark pi d distance. So this pi d distance is equals to 4. So it is around 125 point something that is in millimeter. You can take 125 millimeter only. So I written pi d is equal to 3.14 into 40 that is 125 millimeter. Now divide this pi d distance also in 8 equal parts. So how to divide by previous problem as it is draw acute angle and on this you mark equal 8 part 8 so let's say this is first starting 0 and this is 8 join this point with another end and draw a line parallel to this 0 to 8 to, through this all points you will get this is equally divided in 8 part last so I'll give the notations like first 0 this is 1 2 3 4 like this and last will be 8 in this one now as it is an involute of circle means winding or unwinding a shape of a thread a length of string over a cylinder always this point or the string is tangential to this curve so I need to draw a tangent at every point means from let's say this is center C to C to 1, C to 2, C to 3 for all this radius which I have drawn I need to draw a tangent so I'll use a set square or you can use a drafter to draw a perpendicular lines keeping any one edge means except hypotenuse keeping this edge parallel to C1 another edge will be perpendicular draw a tangent so I'm going to draw a tangent by using set square so at this end I will draw this tangent small tangent you can extend similarly keeping this edge one parallel to this radius draw this this will be another tangent similarly keep this edge parallel and draw the tangent At the end, every radius and this line angle should be 90, that it, it should be tangent. So just extend all these lines. So I have drawn the tangent and extended. Now, which distance you need to mark? Keeping this end on cylinder fixed, so I'll keep this end fixed. Take a distance. Which distance you will take? 
O to one. So take a distance O to one in compass. Mark from which point? Mark from point one. That's it. This you need to follow for every every point. So zero to one, I will take. I will mark from one point on the same tangent. You will get this point. This distance from one. Take take next zero to two distance. Mark this distance from two point on the means I'll say on tangent. So I'll take zero to two distance in compass from second point. I will mark here. So this is my another point. Zero to three distance I'll take in compass. I'll mark from three means from this. I'll take this mark from three somewhere here. I'll show you with compass if have any confusion. Zero to three take this distance in compass. From three as a center mark on the three projector. You will get this point. P three, P two, and P one. Similarly, you will get all points P4, 0 to 4, mark from 4. You'll get on projector of 4. Take a distance 0 to 6, 0 to 5. I'll take 0 to 6. From the 6, I will mark somewhere here. 0 to 7, I'll take a distance 0 to 7 in compass C. 0 to 7 distance from 7. This is 7 point on circle as center mark here. Last one will be 8 point. Now, once you get all these points, join by using free and curve. So I will join now this curve, all the points. So this is your end bullet. Name the curve that is involute. By assuming length of the string is equals to pi d. So how we draw this involute? Draw a circle, divide in eight parts. Draw pi d distance, divide in eight parts. From zero to one, zero to two, mark corresponding distance on the tangent. Draw tangent to every point by using set square or drafter. Take a distance zero one mark from one point zero to three mark from three point on corresponding tangent. Join by using free curve. That is free and curve will get involute of circle.